Hey everyone, this is Sal Congeloso from Geek.com. I'm here with HP's Z600 workstation. Uh, it's all fired up and ready to go, and I just want to do a quick video of it running Cinebench R10 64-bit uh, version. And here goes. I'm going to start the uh, all tests right now as we watch it. As this goes, I just wanted to run over some of the quick specs with you. Uh, and I'm also going to drag into the frame the 16 cores of the system running uh, in uh, Windows Task Manager. So this, like I said, it's a Z600 running two Xeon L5520 processors. Those uh, run a 2.27 gigahertz. The uh, system has six gigabytes of RAM, uh, Vista 64, and it's running NVIDIA Quadro FX 1800 graphics. So uh, just as you can see in the task manager, there's 16 cores running. So that's dual four core or quad core processors with hyper threading uh, enabled. So that's how you get those 16 cores. And right now it's running through, it did the OpenGL standard benchmark and now it's running through the CPU benchmark for the single CPU. It's 2.27 gigahertz, so it's gonna take a little bit. Just a quick note is uh, if you look at the top left hand corner of the task manager you could see the single CPU is cranking or uh, now it's in the middle but there's a single CPU cranking it's running it's only at 7% memory usage is only at 1.49 gigabytes so this is you're pushing that single core pretty hard but you're not really pushing the system.
Okay, the single CPU test is drawing to a close and we are at four minutes and about 20 seconds. Actually, exactly four minutes and 20 seconds. Now, what we're doing is we're gonna go into the, kind of the big test and this is with all the cores running. And so the, the previous score was 3400 if you want to compare your system at home. So we'll see how it does with the multi-core. And as you can see on the top, each one of those cores and those, those uh, hyper-threaded cores, they're all cranking. And the CPU capacity is at 100%. And as you can see, the render is going a bit quicker. Okay, so that's it, it's over. The score for the multi-CPU was 21790, that's 21,790. So that's a multi-processor multi speed up factor of 6.41, which is uh, pretty good because in real life, we're using uh, four cores times two CPUs, so eight cores, instead of the single core. Uh, you could factor in hyper-threading if you want or not. Anyway, so it's a pretty good speed up factor. And if you want to compare at home, the OpenGL standard score is 5679. So this is Geek.com with HP's Z600 workstation. Thanks for watching and you can check back on the site for a full review.